Okay, guys, it's Hooters here with In Maniac coming at you live from ACL Melbourne 2011. We're just packing up the venue now, but we're just grabbing a few quick minutes with Infused here. They clean swept uh, the Halo 3 tournament here. They didn't drop a single series. Halo Reach tournament, sorry. They didn't drop a single series. Uh, Hef, tell me, some of the games, they did look pretty close. Were you ever, do you ever feel like Frey was sort of had a chance of maybe getting a few and putting the scoreboard pressure on you? Um, yeah, I seen we were playing a bit frantic at times. Um, we just slowed down and played our game, really. And, you know, it just, just comes from our experience, I guess, of knowing just not to just start freaking out when you, like, have your backs against the wall. Just play calm and play your game and you'll just do fine. Benno, how much preparation were you actually, did you actually put into this? Have you been gaming it as heavily as you did reach, uh, Halo 3, sort of heading into Columbus and stuff like that, or were you taking it a bit slow? Uh, no, we definitely... I haven't played as much uh, Reach as we have Halo 3, but um, yeah, that mic isn't annoying at all. <laughs> um, yeah, right. Um, no, nah, we wanted to practice more, but just like our schedules clash like a lot, and it's a bit difficult to all get on at the same time. I think we can get like two days a week or something like to practice, and then that like relies on the Frey guys being on as well, so a bit hard, but yeah, hopefully they'll fix the playlist soon. So, Hacks, you've had a few wins with BBR. This is your first with Infused. Was it the easiest win you've had? You had a fair few tough ones on BBR. Oh, I just felt that um, these guys just totally, you know, pulled me over the line and I really didn't contribute so much to this event and uh, I don't know about easy, but I mean, uh, I don't really know what I can say here. I just, they did a good job. I didn't do a good job. You did a fine job, Hack. <laughs> <laughs> and Voltage, I guess Hef's now at uni. You've got your footy and everything. You've got hacks on the team over in WA with time differences. Is it hard for you guys to sort of, and Benno doing his thing, is it sort of hard for you guys to, you know, practice as much as you could even just a year ago? Has, has a lot changed? Yeah, well, a year ago leading up to Colum when you were going to Columbus, so we just, everyone just put everything aside just to practice because we really wanted to do well then. I and work. since we haven't, um, since we haven't really, we haven't really had that drive sort of yet of Halo Reach, plus we don't all enjoy it as much as we did Halo 3. We just haven't felt like we have to um, play as much as we did for Halo Reach, but... Halo 3. Halo 3. <laughs> it's confusing, I know. I mean, Hef, I guess with you guys signing on to Infuse, one of the things that we first sort of, sort of heard was you'd hopefully be attending some European events, just had Voltage and saying like the drive isn't there as much, something like that something that'll probably spark the drive again. Is Europe still on the cards in the future? Um, yeah, we're hopefully, um, hope that we're hopefully heading overseas sometime in the near future. That could be anywhere from six months to a year, I guess. I mean, you know, we're just taking it slow and if we get the opportunity, we're gonna jump at it and uh, really try and place as well as we can. But um, at the moment, we're just gonna you know, do our thing, just keep playing how we are, just make sure we keep sharp and if we, do get an event that's going to happen overseas we're going to make sure that we're going there and we're going to go to win and the event overall i mean freya was probably your biggest competition but any teams in particular i mean you swept most people but any teams stand out to sort of challenge a bit i heard you dropped a game to x and y oh he's admitted it girlfriend sorry Royal fan. I, I didn't talk to her but I'm, he's in love she's it's cute i think i'm in love <laughs> <laughs> she had to admire me like four times i was just is it magic? Nervous. Does it? Does it? Uh, is it true? She has like this weird crouch and strafe thing at the same time. It's it's like the it's like a, it's like a Gandhi but on the ground and she at the Amaji. But mind you, you're probably just standing there in shock or dumbstruck by her presence. Maybe have. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, I think it's gone downhill now. So, uh, any real shout outs uh, you'd like to give just beforehand? Um, I got a couple. All right, first one should go to Sammy K and Nat B, our managers. Um, we wouldn't be here without them. They've done so much for us. We really appreciate everything we do. And um, just on the note of Sammy K, I think going on time differences, I'm not sure. It's his birthday, maybe. Happy birthday to Sammy. Happy birthday. Um, but it might be tomorrow or um, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but happy birthday, Sammy. Um, I guess also we should give out some shout outs to Thermal Take and uh, Infuse. Um, the headsets we had this weekend actually were really great. Um, I've come from having no sound to just, you know, having incredible sound with the headsets and just made it so much easier. So that was really great and, you know, yeah. Um, anything else? Anyone want to add anything in? Yeah, I'll have to give one to Sussy and uh, his mum. This rang me before and asked for one, so what's up, Sussy? <laughs> See you in Sydney soon. Um, 
nah, for Frey, trying the hardest, but uh, just wasn't good enough. Boys. Oh, yeah. Oh, should probably throw this one. And, uh, of course, Vans and all the staff here, they've done a great job, you know. <laughs> Can't forget them. I know they're easy to forget, but they do a wonderful job behind the scenes, and they make everything happen here for everyone. So, you know, they really don't get enough respect and um, praise that they deserve. Beautiful. Well, thanks, guys. Um, we just finally also like to say from ACL, thanks everyone for watching. Also, thanks heaps to Razor. Got the Onza control here. It's fantastic. We've had a whole bunch of people playing with them uh, so far this week, and everyone's been loving them. So, thanks heaps, Razor, and uh, we'll see you guys uh, in Sydney in hopefully in July.